What's up everyone, it's Jan Bors, new video, new focus slash review as you are a bit confused of how I'm calling it reaction as I don't do those reactions videos, you know, playing it, watching it for the first time. No, I'm not doing it, I've just seen it many many times to digest it a bit and build kind of a feeling for the song or understandment or statement or opinion, whatever, let's call it the focus or a review and let's focus on Russia, Russian woman Maniza, who just won the national selection. Let's talk about it. Well guys, and before I get started, please like the video, subscribe the channel or consider it and I'll ask you to watch the whole video, you know, the context is the thing which is very important, I think, you know, it's always about the context and we should learn this as uh, sometimes they're just you know very unnecessary misunderstandings and that would happen if I would react for the song Russian woman at this video if I just do the reaction classical reaction video you know push play and just react on what I see because first scene and first screening of this video first screening of this song the live performance of Maniza, Maniza, well, tell me in the comments below, please. The first screening was like, what the hell the, the mess is? What is the song about? What part of the song is the actual song? Because I first thought it's kind of a medley of songs or, you know, it wasn't that coherent. It was like, well, let's go rapping, let's go, well, let's go Russian language, chanting, then we go ballad kind of style. Then the whole power inside, very different, dancey, and I was like, what a mess is this? But then, I, as I said before, I kind of digest it and watch it again and listen to it again and trying to kill all those prejudices I have inside of me, which, I don't know, starts with the Russian language, which I really don't like, which is just, you know, it just sounds really weird. To me, even, you know, Slavic languages, it's all very different, as well with the accent. And the start is like with Ruchichki, which means hands in Czech the same. And it was like, ah, my ears just bleeding and I'm dying, you know. And then it just came to the, the, the English and the rap part and then the ex as well the Russian part. And it's about like, it's like feminist song. And I was starting to thinking like, do I kind of like it? And I'll tell you what, I have like two really opinions which are opposed to each other. First is that the song is a mess, that the song did, don't know what it wants to be. But the other part is saying, well, it exactly knows what it wants to be. It's just say, I do whatever I want. I'm a Russian woman, you know. And I kind of like the message. And what I kind of like on this song is original. It's definitely original. I would say it's the most original song Russia ever sent. And it's more natural as well. I feel Maniza's kind of power in it. Like she knows what she's singing about or she believes what she's singing about or it's her topic kind of and this kind of message it really feels like okay guys let's let's give such artists a place you know i don't know if it's a fake or true whatever but definitely it's sound and and look like really proper show great performance by manja just great performance it's 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 really a pleasure to watch her doing it all this charisma and you know hard feelings or like I'm the alpha woman here, you know, like, I'm the queen of, of this thing and I like it and I, I think that's as well kinda important and I kinda even like that there's like uh, folk things or Russian vibes in it as maybe that's as well what Eurovision can be about, you know, I don't feel it's constructed or I don't even feel it's obsolete or old school or dated, it's just what it is like 2021 mashup whatever whatever but I don't have this feeling I just don't know if this can qualify I know it's a Russia and we all tend to say they will always make it through because of the diaspora and a lot of Russians living all around 
well, that can happen and the question is, I kind of don't believe it has this appeal or the super quality which this semi-final already has. I think it can struggle. On the other hand, I really would like it to go through and that's maybe weird for me saying it, but I really believe that can like such song can inspire much more people than all of those kind of derivative songs or you know cliche already heard sounds that we know and maybe that's the factor which can help Russia go through the semi-final. I'm pretty sure it's not the winning material as there are other really great original sounds and songs and even those bit derivative songs are great or you know generic whatever it means but this is a thing which is good for inspiration and that's what Eurovision should be about as well and a great experiment and I'm glad that Russia is sending something like this instead of, of crafted songs which are only made for great stagings which are actually much better than the songs. This is a performance I would like to watch much better, even it's more Eurovision. Like, well, this is something I just can't decide in myself, if it's just a Eurovision craft or it's really original, but that's not up to me to decide anyway, it's up to you. So tell me what you really think, what you think about my opinions, give me your opinions, let's talk about it, I think that, that this will split us into two groups, yes or no. I'm somewhere in between. I'm still not sure if I super like it or I definitely know I don't dislike it, but I'm definitely not sure if I really like it, but I really appreciate it. That's the thing. So tell me in the comments below how much you appreciate or not the song and the artist or the performance, whatever regarding the song. And don't forget to subscribe the channel, like the video, share it among your friends and let me grow. Well, and I see you next time, guys.